Hello lovelies. Leslie, not quite enough patience with my own mistakes this week. How are we? Hope everyone's okay. Um, hope everyone's keeping well. Thank you for all your comments and thoughts. Uh, thank you for your very warm uh, reception of my mate Mandy. I mean, she doesn't get out much, bless her. If the best I can do is take her to a funeral, then then thank you for being so kind to her. <laughs> bless her. No, she um, she was a good sport, and I thank you for uh, for being so lovely towards her. No. This week, uh, more of the same. Uh, hospital visiting on Sunday. Uh, Patient is continuing to do well, but is frustrated by lack of progress as they perceive it. The rest of us are thinking, yeah, it's going all right, but them not. But you can understand. It's been a while. So, uh, but they are, they're doing okay. They're doing well. Then the rest of the week, work. Um, I didn't go drumming last night. I've got this stupid tickly cough. It's not the dreaded. But uh, I decided not to go to drum practice because I thought I'm just going to cough all the way through it and unnerve a lot of people. Well, I decided against that. So I sat home, sat quietly knitting. And I've now decided I'm going to unpick everything I was knitting last night. And for a while, my multi shades of red sweater, I don't like the way it's coming along. Um, not the pattern's fault, stuff I've tried to do to it basically isn't working. So I'm going to have a rethink. I'm going to go with a different pattern. Nothing wrong with the pattern, just not working the way I'd envisaged. So I am going to do, because of course what I have at the moment is a lovely big swatch. And the gauge matches Floof by Skane Deer. I have made one of these before. I made it a cardigan. I'm going for a sweater this time. It's a contiguous shoulder. So you get the sort of like thin saddle shoulder and you increase that as you go along and it's all very, very clever. And apart from that, fairly straightforward, crew neck, straight body, long sleeved sweater. And I think it will work better for what I was trying to do. And I'm not going to do part of what I was trying to do because it wasn't working. So yes, I'm going to unpick my red sweater and be sad. But it's nice yarn. I'll use it again. As I ha have been thinking recently, better to make a sweater I'm going to wear than one that I like knitting, but I'm not going to wear. Because there's no point in that. Resources are precious. They should not be wasted on things that aren't used. Oh, I'm getting all, all of a one. Can you tell? Anyway, my lovelies, I will see you later in the week. Cheers. Hello, lovelies. I have just finished my final tech editing assignment. Yippee! Of course, it may be a complete disaster. I'll find out when I get the results. But hopefully, I haven't made a complete dog's breakfast out of it and it'll be fine. Fingers crossed. <laughs> I've done me sums properly, I hope. Yes, so I have pretty much finished. There's a few little admin -y bits to finish up, but we're done. And this grin is the grin of someone who has finished her assignments, which I had wanted to do sometime before, but this year is just it's not working that way. Although this weekend will be the first weekend this year that I haven't had to do some writing up or some work. So I'm going to make the most of it. I'm going to do two things. Firstly, I'm going to put the monthly podcast up. You lucky people. And secondly, it's the Zoom call hosted by Barbara of the Flame and Fibre podcast and the lovely Valerie, who looks after all the Zoom stuff. Uh, that's this weekend. It's 2 p.m. Eastern Time USA. If you are on Ravelry and you go on to the Flame and Fibre uh, group, there's a, at the top of the threads, there's one that's stickied and that's got all the details. Or if you watch Barbara, which I'm sure you do with her daily vlog, she puts the details there as well. So, um, yes, that's this weekend, that's Saturday. So I'm looking forward to that. That will be a nice thing to do. I have 
all new projects pretty much on the go at the moment or that's how it feels because I've restarted the red sweater I've just started the harvest I feel like I want to start the remodeled version of four as well the Nicola Suzanne that I'm reworking this will all make sense in the month end podcast tomorrow if I haven't covered that in this podcast because this vlog because I don't know base from apex at the moment it's a nice way of saying it isn't it uh, <laughs> but I'm going to have a celebratory cup of tea and look forward to my weekend I'm wearing my uh, second magpie tendency this is the second one that I made did it in sport weight yarn rather than fingering I put this chevron pattern in a little bit wide on the neck I need to do something with that and this shawl I made a long, long time ago. This was called Le Weekend, I think. Le, as in French for the weekend. And it's a handy little shawlette because with the, the big neck on this sweater, my, the back of my neck was getting chilly. And that fits the bill rather nicely. So, so yes, I'm feeling very chilled. Possibly dangerously so, because one phone call and I'll have to start thinking again. But we're all good. I hope that you have a good week ahead of you. I hope that you're keeping well and that whatever you're doing brings you a bit of smile, a bit of fun. Weather here is miserable. It's raining quite hard. And I think we're due fairly mixed weather for the next week as well. But it's spring in the UK. It's going to rain some of the time. So, my lovelies, pictures of the dog to follow. Hopefully, I'll see you on the Zoom call tomorrow evening. Evening my time, afternoon or morning, depending on where you are. And I will catch up with you next week or tomorrow if you watch the monthly podcast. Thanks, everyone. Take good care of yourselves. Bye-bye.